Hi guys, my name is La Shanique and this is my very first YouTube video. Um, as you'll see, I'm a curly girl. And this right here is third day hair. Can you believe it? So as you'll see, my curls are still very defined and I have a lot of volume and um, normally when I go out I'll get a lot of questions about what products I use or how I get my curls like this and how long does it last or am I combing it every day and no I'm not combing it every day I comb my hair once a week and this wash and go will last me all week long until that following week where I go and rewash and start all over again so um, I'm bringing to you guys a curly hair tutorial to show you how to do your curls so that they can last just as long as I am because I know everybody gets tired of combing their hair every day. I know having curly hair isn't as easy as everyone makes it seem. It's definitely not easy. It's a lot of work and maintain and trying to keep your hair moisturized and not dry and trying to keep your ends from not breaking off. So I'm going to bring to you guys this curly hair tutorial and please stay tuned. You want to start off with freshly washed hair and for me my hair is washed with the diva curl no poo and conditioned with the Aussie moist and it's already combed out section off into three different parts and you want to section off smaller pieces within those three different sections especially if you have thicker hair like I do and the first thing you want to do is get your hair drenched in water you want to make sure that it's soaking wet because this is going to help give you those defined curls now you want to apply your moisture. For me, I'm using Shea Moisture Raw Shea Butter Extra Moisture Transitioning Milk. This stuff works amazing, it smells really good, and it leaves your hair really soft. So after you work that in there, you want to seal in that moisture with some oil. For me, I'm using a few different oils that I put together. Um, it smells good and it works really good. You want to make sure that you focus on the ends. So you want to make sure that you coat every strand of hair with this oil and really focus on those ends. Use your Denman brush to comb out your curls. This brush is made especially for curls because it gets them clumped together and it helps get them extremely defined as you'll see. Now you want to take your gel. I personally like to start at the roots of my hair and make my way all the way down to the ends. You want to make sure that you get every strand of hair coated with this gel because this is what will give you those long lasting curls that will last you all week. Don't be afraid to use more gel if you have to. Remember, you want to make sure every strand of hair is coated in that gel. Now you want to take your Denman brush just to brush those curls out one last time and get them all clumped together. Sometimes I like to use a little bit more gel, just using the prior hand method and smoothing that gel in to the ends, just to make sure it's extra coated. Now you want to repeat these same steps throughout the rest of your head, starting off by parting it to smaller sections.
So this is now seven hours later. After air drying, my hair is about 95% dry. The curls are very defined, however, it's really crunchy. So in order to break that gel cast, you wanna use your oil and the prayer hand method. Gently push against those curls, just pulling them to break that gel cast. You wanna make sure that your hands are coated in oil before you do this, otherwise you'll create a lot of frizz. I personally am not a big fan of day one hair because my hair looks really short and there's not much volume. So what I normally do is put my hair in a pineapple ponytail. I'll wrap the scrunchie around one time very loosely and if I go out, I'll just swoop the hair around and pin it just to make it look like a bun. And what this does is stretch those curls out. It helps give you more length and also more volume. So I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I hope it was very helpful to you curly girls out there. Please give this um, routine a try and comment below and let me know how it works for you. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. And um, I will also post pictures of my, my hair throughout the week because this is third day hair. But I'm gonna post pictures after this of my fourth, fifth, six and seven day hair so you guys can see and i just want to prove to you that this lasts me all week long okay thanks for watching